Um, while we're returning a lot, I think I think a big project for us was was our back end. We wanted to improve our defensive uh, uh, area of our team this year, uh, not only defensively but offensively as well. We thought we lacked some scoring um, from the blue line last year. I think that our defensemen only accounted for two or three percent of our scoring last year. That's something we look to address with adding some players who can chip in on the power play and add some, some offense from the from the back end. Well, I, I don't think anything's going to be any different. Our, you know, with the addition of the the wilderness, you know, I, I think all the teams in this area. I mean, I think it goes without saying. Like, if you don't play 60 minutes, you, you're not going to win every single night. So, um, I expect it to be deep as always. Uh, anybody can win on every night. I think there's great parity in our division, and that's what makes it a fun division to be in. Um, well, I, th I think every coach in every group is you're going to come in and you're going to have the same goals, right? You, you want to win the division. You want to get home ice advantage. Uh, you you want to host playoff games. You want to have a shot at going to the Robertson Cup. I think those things go on without saying. But we just want to be process driven. We want to focus on the things that make us better each day and, and accomplish those things each you know, every day and hold ourselves accountable to those things. And over time, that adds up and we, we stick to the process. We get better every day and have a chance. Oh, it's exciting. I, I think it's goes. It's you know, it says a lot about the coaches in our league, and the skill level in our league, and the thing our league does to expose our players. I think it's real exciting. Um, I think it's a great recruiting tool for us and our relationships with NCAA schools. Like it's very exciting. Uh, the people, right? Like the hockey's a people business. You get to see the college coaches, the other coaches in the league. And uh, and get to hang out with some people and watch hockey. I think that's the fun. That's the funnest part for me, anyway. I know the kids like the the attention from all the scouts, and there's a ton of energy in the building, and they really enjoy that. And getting in front of the playing some different teams in front of some different people. So I think that's the most exciting thing. Uh, it's a great community. They do a great job supporting our team. It's uh, Riverside's a fun arena to play in. There's a, definitely an atmosphere. Uh, one of the biggest reasons I enjoy being here and, and coaching here. Uh, I, you know, like like I said earlier, I think it's the skill level. I think our skill levels increased. I think there's some good young players in our league as well, some older guys who are still fighting for a chance, and that balances things out. I think there's better depth of talent now. The coaching gets better every single year, and it's it's competitive every night. And it's good hockey, and it's good hockey for the kids uh, as far as development for them, and for the schools to watch as well. Uh, you know, I, I think we, we stick with what we're good at. You know, we always we want to be a puck possession team. We want to be tough to play against. We, will, we want to pressure the puck and, and, and play the game with pace and play fast, both offensively and defensively.